Hi, welcome. This is your weekend tarot reading and it's for Capricorn. So I hope you're doing all right. I hope your week's gone all right. Can't believe it's the weekend reading. Here we are. Um, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for supporting. Thanks for sharing and booking in. Um, all those things you're doing is really helping me to help the channel going. So thank you. Um, growing and progressing. <laughs> so cards for you. Right, you've got You've got four cards, but I'm just going to take the top one because um, that's the one I can see. So let's go with the top one. Something new and exciting. Messenger of action. Mm, so you could be getting a message here. You could be receiving a message from somebody or something. Something new and exciting related to creativity or your career comes to your attention. You feel an eagerness to learn. You're ready to get going. Um, you may feel a bit insecure. Do it anyway. This card represents someone in your life who's creative, enthusiastic and fascinated by life and wants to try every, everything. This could be you. So yeah, page of wands. This could be somebody who's quite childlike in your life, who just likes to go on adventures. Okay, and they could be slightly ungrounded, by the way. Um, now, it could be you as well, if you're sort of really deciding to step forward into your passion, doing something new something different you know um and um it's something that will excite you but you've got to be careful to kind of stay on track and not get distracted so let's go a bit deeper for you capricorn because if it's a young person or an immature person connected to you they get very distracted they get pulled off their path they get really enthusiastic but then sometimes they get pulled off their path you know Okay, so you may have felt disrespected lately because we've got the emperor here reversed. You may have felt quite unstable um, or disrespected by somebody. Now, what you're doing is really good. You're coming into more of a space of self-love over the weekend. So you're going to realise, actually, I don't need to let this affect me. I've got the love within myself. I've got spirit within myself. You know, I actually feel really good in myself. Um, also, you're really a vibrational match for love, to be honest with you, with this page of cups. This is heart chakra energy and it's very spiritual energy. You could be having a spiritual awakening. Um, you're realising you just need to surrender. You can't control situations and I think you're kind of stepping back and saying, you know what, I can't control this situation, it's fine. I'd rather be at peace, I'd rather be in my heart vibration and I'm okay with it. And surrendering is a very divine... Um, it's a very divine energy. So when you surrender, you actually align yourself to spirit. And if you align yourself to spirit, then obviously amazing miracles can happen in your life. Um, and you're also letting go of this rejected or abandoned feeling. So I feel like health improving for you, money improving, and even connections with other people improving. So really, this is a very good weekend for you. It's a healing weekend. And um, like I said, you're... You're working through a lot of things um, and I feel like it's going to, you're actually going to move forward more quickly than you realise. Even if there's been some tricky aspects lately, you're going to move forward more quickly than you realise into following your passions, being in your alignment and attracting the right opportunities and the right people. So people better watch out because Capricorn, <laughs> Capricorn will not be... Uh, put asunder you will not be um worn down is what i'm saying by the matrix so there's somebody here that's kind of realizing they needed to drop drop all the stuff they're doing this person's quite needy okay this person's quite needy they were trying to sort of like do too much and now they're realizing they need to kind of drop the act if you like uh, calm things down <laughs> and be real they need to be real with themselves about actually, you know, not taking on too much and spreading themselves too thin. And they need to, I think they've realised they need to give themselves attention, uh, which is good because this person definitely needs to give themselves attention. Uh, the fact they're doing this is much better because it means they're moving into their alignment now. So there's a good message there for that person, whoever that person is. They're calming things down. They're looking at themselves, um, they're healing themselves, and they're getting themselves in a better alignment. Let's have a look at the Lover's Oracle for you. Okay. 
balance. Love is not always about agreeing just for the sake of it. A great relationship is one that both supports and challenges. So sometimes it's like through the, the tests and the real hard parts of a relationship, you, you sort of, you kind of awaken each other, you stretch each other, you trigger each other, you're making each other grow, expand into your true light. So there's uncomfortable aspects, but then it's like, actually, yeah, you haven't felt too good, this other person hasn't felt too good, but ultimately you're coming out of it ready for ready for life, whatever life is going to bring you. Very open energy and your person the same. So you're both going to come through this really well. Let's have a look at another relationship card for you. Okay. Hmm. Right, you've got somebody here who's a bit of a leader. Okay, I do think this person can be quite dominant because they say, let me take the lead. So, you know, that is their energy. They would rather always be the one that's leading everything. Okay, so they don't really want you pushing. They would rather be doing that. Okay, and also here, I am more emotional than I show. So they do have emotions, but I think things have to be on their terms and it always has to be at their pace, what they're comfortable with. So, you know, whatever. But at the end of the day, they're doing their thing. They're sorting themselves out. You're doing your thing. You're sorting yourself out. And you're coming into a really nice energy over the weekends. You'll be at peace with everything. And you'll be saying to yourself, do you know what? Like, I'm ready for life and open to life. I'm open to spirit. Um, you're vibrationally aligning to kind of adventure and love. So that's the message, Capricorn. If you do like it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. If you'd like one-to-one -one tarot, I'm here. Just contact me and I'm sending you lots of love, lots of peace for the weekend, wherever you are on Gaia.